I was born 87 years ago. For 65 years, I've ruled as Tamriel's emperor. But for all these years, I've never been the ruler of my own dreams. I have seen the gates of oblivion, beyond which no waking eye may see. Behold, in darkness, a doom sweeps the land. This is the 27th of last seed, the year of Akatosh 433. These are the closing days of the third era and the final hours of my life.
My, my, you're a big one. A Nord, I guess, right? So strong. But you can't bend steel, can you, boy? You can't do anything to get out of here. And those big muscles? They're going to waste away. When the end comes, you won't even have the strength to cry for your mother. That's right. You're going to die in here. You hear... Hey, you hear that? The guards are coming. For you. <laughs> Morris, lock that door behind us. Yes, sir. My son. My job right now is to get you to safety. What's this prisoner doing here? This cell is supposed to be off limits. Usual mix up with the watch. I. Never mind. Get that gate open. Stand back, prisoner. We won't hesitate to kill you if you get in our way. No sign of pursuit. Stay put, prisoner. Good. Let's go. We're not out of this yet. You. I've seen you. Let me see your face. You are the one from my dreams. Then the stars were right. And this is the day. Gods give me strength. Assassins attacked my sons, and I am next. My blades are leading me out of the city along a secret escape route. By chance, the entrance to that escape route leads through your cell. I am your emperor, Uriel Septim. By the grace of the gods, I serve Tamriel as her ruler. You are a citizen of Tamriel, and you too shall serve her in your own way. Perhaps the gods have placed you here so that we may meet. As for what you have done, it does not matter. That is not what you will be remembered for. You will find your own path. Take care. There will be blood and death before the end. Please, sire, we must keep moving. Better not close this one. There's no way to open it from the other side. Looks like this is your lucky day. Just stay out of our way. Don't try anything. I'm watching you. Do as you're told and you'll be all right. There's trouble ahead. Close up left. Don't try Protect anything. the Emperor. The captain's down. Are you all right, sire? We're clear for now. Captain Reno? She's dead. Sorry, sire, but we have to keep moving. How could they be waiting for us here? Don't know, but it's too late to go back now. to underestimate. I'll take point. Let's move. You stay here, prison. Don't try to follow us.
until help arrives. Help? What makes you think help will get here before more of those bastards? We need here to get the Emperor out of here. Ah! No, he is not one of them. He can help us. He must help us. As you... They cannot understand why I trust you. They've not seen what I've seen. How can I explain? Listen, you know the Nine, how they guide our fates with an invisible hand. I've served the Nine all my days, and I chart my course by the cycles of the heavens. The skies are marked with numberless sparks, each a fire, and every one a sign. 
I know these stars well, and I wonder which sign marked your birth. The signs I read show the end of my path. My death, a necessary end, will come when it will come. Your stars are not mine. Today the warrior shall prove a stalwart companion when fortune fades. My dreams grant me no opinions of success. Their compass ventures not beyond the doors of death. But in your face, I behold the sun's companion. The dawn of Akatosh's bright glory may banish the coming darkness. With such hope, and with the promise of your aid, my heart must be satisfied. No trophies of my triumphs precede me, but I have lived well, and my ghost shall rest easy. Men are but flesh and blood. They know their doom but not the hour. In this, I am blessed to see the hour of my death, to face my apportioned fate, then fall. I go to my grave, a tongue shriller than all the music calls me. You shall follow me yet for a while, then we must part. You may as well make yourself useful. Carry that torch and stick close. We're the Emperor's bodyguards. Our job is to get him out of situations like this. Although I admit, things are not going according to plan. My job is to make sure the Emperor gets out of here alive, and I intend to do it. Stick close and let us do our job, and you'll be all right. Not much farther. Oblivion! Take for you! Their needs help! What? For the Emperor! You die! That's not smart. Don't push me, prisoner. Hold up. I don't like this. Let me take a look. Looks clear. Come on. We're almost through to the sewers. The gate is barred from the other side. A trap! What about that side passage back there? Worth a try. Let's go.
It's a dead end. What's your call, sir? I don't know. I don't see any good options here. They're behind us! Wait here, sire. Wait here with the Emperor. Guard him with your life. For, For the, the Emperor! Emperor! You thought we'd go down easy? I can go no further. You alone must stand against the Prince of Destruction and his mortal servants. He must not have the Amulet of Kings. Take the amulet. Give it to Joffrey. He alone knows where to find my last son. Find him and close shut the jaws of oblivion. Ha! Take him down. You chose a bad. We failed. The amulet. Where's the amulet of kings? It wasn't on the emperor's body. Strange. He saw something in you. Trusted you. They say it's the dragon blood that flows through the veins of every septum. They see more than lesser men. The amulet of kings is a sacred symbol of the empire. Most people think of the red dragon crown, but that's just jewelry. The amulet has power. Only a true heir of the blood can wear it, they say. He must have given it to you for a reason. Did he say why? Joffrey? He said that? Why? Nothing I ever heard about. But Joffrey would be the one to know. He's the Grand Master of my order. Although you may not think so to meet him, he lives quietly as a monk at Wainan Priory, near the city of Coral. First, you need to get out of here. Through that door must be the entrance to the sewers, past the locked gate. That's where we were heading. It's a secret way out of the Imperial City. Or it was supposed to be secret. Here, you'll need this key for the last door into the sewers. There are rats and goblins down there. But from what I've seen of you, I'm guessing you're an experienced barbarian. Am I right?
I wasn't far off. In any case, rats and goblins won't give you any trouble. You must get the amulet to Joffrey. Take no chances, but proceed to Wayne in Priory immediately. Got it? Good. The Emperor's trust was well placed. I'll stay here to guard the Emperor's body and make sure no one follows you. You'd better get moving. May Talos guide you. By the way, thanks for recovering Glenroy's sword. I'll see that it is given a place of honor in the Halls of the Blades. <laughs>